Yep, that's right. Today we got the leader of the Decepticons. Well, at least we got his head. What's in the box? Welcome to another episode of What's in the Box. I'm your host, GQ. Do me a favor. Hit the subscribe button. I would have waited an eternity for this. Like the video, leave some comments on this video and the other ones that I've done. Share the video, spread some of that culture junkies live around the world, and... I don't know. Make sure you leave some comments down below and some other good stuff. Do all the stuff you're supposed to do when you go to a YouTube video. Anyway, today, got something that I picked up while on uh, vacation not too long ago. So I decided, I've got a ton of other helmets, some of which you guys have seen. I've unboxed some, of course. So why not uh, get some iconic helmets from the 80s cartoons? I mean, I already got Snake Eyes and Cobra Commander. So... We got Megatron from the Modern Icons line. So of course you got a picture of Megatron on the front there, another picture of Megatron on the side. You have a throwback image, and I'll try to get a close up of this. Throwback image of, um, I think it was actually, I, I call it Gen one and a half, because <laughs> this wasn't the first line of toys, but this is when they had Metroplex and some of the other toys that showed up. Um, so basically a recreation of that artwork that you used to get on the back of larger Transformers uh, back in the day. And uh, yeah, and then we're, of course, another image of Megatron on the side. So yeah, I think this is cool. I'm going to be very happy to unbox this. And I think I've got the wrong type of battery. So if when we get to the sound portion and all that, I will have to grab some other batteries. So no big deal, whatever. Get to that later. It is a little uh, <laughs> unkept secret that uh, Megatron is one of my favorite characters of all time. Always liked him, always liked Optimus Prime, um, Duke, and Snake Eyes. Those were my main characters from the 80s that were, that's just who I rocked with. That was always the characters that I was rooting for, was always happy to see them when they showed up on screen. And, huh, okay, a little bit more in there. <laughs> this is a wearable helmet, believe it or not, <laughs> which in and of itself is, is awesome. So of course he needs batteries because his eyes light up. And also I think he says a couple of phrases, but I mean, you can even see right off the bat. There's some on the turntable. That is a really good sculpt of Megatron. I mean, it's, it's, it looks like you've literally just ripped his head off. Well, obviously he'd, he'd be quite a bit bigger. But um, yeah, looks like he basically kind of shrunk him down to human size, basically, and ripped his head off. And now I'm sitting it up here on my table. Um, there are, when I'm looking at the close ups, it looks like it's damaged. It's almost like basically battle worn damage, which is cool. I mean, it's, you know, kind of a, it's not thankfully as bad as it got when he was in the movie fighting Optimus Prime. But I mean, it's a little, you know, 400, you know, 4 million years old. So I mean, he's going to have a little bit of scraping and scarring and all that other sort of thing. Uh, let's see. Oh, these things. God, these are so annoying. Uh, if I can get this adjusted, I might put this on for, for a quick minute. Just guessing as far as what would be a comfortable size. Oh, that's not bad. It's actually better than they've been in the past. Something like that, maybe? And then you just kind of rotate to tighten. I love the red lenses. I mean, obviously all, you know, Decepticon's eyes are red. So, I mean, of course that's the way it would be. But, um, looks really good actually. So let's see. You know what, let's take a quick peek at the instructions just to make sure I'm putting that in right. I love how they just always just say, yeah, just do this. And then they give you no real direction. It's just kind of like, yeah, this will work exactly the way we pictured it. And the picture usually never makes any sense. Mm -hmm. well, there's gonna be one side that works. There's the other. Cool. All right. Yeah, that is very hard to see out of. It kind of pressing really hard on my nose. But, 
the view with all the red looks great. Um, yeah, this is a bit painful. Definitely a display piece. <laughs> Purely a display piece. But I dig it though. I do. I mean, it's my favorite, one of my favorite characters. I'm sure I look awesome right now. Um, but yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take that off though. A little bit difficult to wear. So, like I said, I'm gonna get uh, some of the voice samples and everything, because again, I grabbed the wrong size batteries. Did not realize it needs AAA batteries, not AA. A lot of stuff's not taking AA anymore. It's kind of annoying. AA is, you know, easy to get. I mean, obviously AAA is easy to get too, but still, most people have AA batteries laying around. Anyway, so that's what was in the box. The awesome Modern Icons Megatron helmet. Um, stick around and somewhere down the line, I'm pretty sure some other Transformers head will be showing up soon. So again, if you've enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, you know, comment, subscribe to the channel and all that other good stuff. Also make sure you check out culturejunkies.net and our Patreon. So it'd be really messed up of me if I did not mention our awesome patrons, Demarcus Smith, Fab Nerd Life, The Net Net, The Iguana Man, and The Other Steve. They are all Culture Junkies level patrons and above. They uh, support us and we appreciate all the support that we can get. And for as little as a dollar a month, you can support a Culture Junkie. So just go over to our Patreon, which is patreon.com slash culture junkies. And you can sign up and choose the tier that fits you. Choose the right tier. You can get a shout out from yours truly, not only here, but also on our live show, which we do every Wednesday on Twitch, which is twitch.tv slash culture junkies. That is at 9 p.m. Eastern time. Culture Junkies live, ton of fun on that show. There's even a segment on there called The Power Is Yours where you, the viewer, can take over the show. Just leave your comments in there and we will talk about what the stuff that you guys bring up in the comments. So, once again, for the Modern Icons Megatron helmet, I'm GQ. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>